hello everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Tanisha and as you can tell by the title I'm going to be doing a thrift haul slash try on so since quarantine started I have been going crazy with the thrifting and I love it so much it's just addicting like you can't stop anymore but um I'm only going to show y'all what I got in between the past two to three weeks because if I show you everything this video is never going to come to an end and I'm only going to show y'all also the clothes that I only got for myself because I got my sister more clothes than I got myself and she's already like gone with her clothes and everything. So if you want to see the diamonds and the rough that I have found, just continue watching. Okay, so for starters, excuse my crustiness. And I'm going to be starting off with the clothes that I got from Plato's Closet and Corpus Christi. Honestly, they have way better quality clothes, clothing and pricing than the one here in San the ones here in San Antonio that I've been to. So the first thing that I got is these Gymshark dupes. They fit me just like Gymshark. The length is great. Stretchy, squat proof, and I got them for, I believe, $6. So they are super comfy, grab me in all the right places. They don't slide down if I do squats or whatnot. Super cute. And boom, next, I got these leggings as well. And I really like them. I like the little texture thing. I don't know if you can see. They're squat proof as well. I like how they complement the booty and such and the color. I got these for six bucks as well. And now for the biggest deal from Play-Doh's was going to be shoes. So I never really thrift shoes because I've really just been iffy about it. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I just have very sensitive feet. And the only reason why I got these is because they were brand spanking new. Like literally still had tags and everything on them. And the first pair, honestly, it's because I've been having a lot. I stopped using Nike a long time ago and got into buying Adidas. And now I've been thrifting a lot more Nike than Adidas. So I got these brand new Nike shoes. They're honestly kind of worn because I've been using them in between like since I bought them. And they're like... If you can see they still look super brand new i got them for 20 bucks 20 bucks brand new with tags and everything i mean now i use the heck out of them but these were brand new when i bought them and obviously i put those in the washer as well there's no way and my favorite steal of all was these nike vapor max for 20 bucks as well let that zoom in they're brand spanking new too when i got them so, yep, favorites. Oops, let me pick that up. The next place I thrifted at was the it's called Texas Thrift. And I really love this place because I honestly find more stuff here than anywhere else for very good pricing. These are kind of like, I don't think Gymshark has these exact ones, but I feel like these are kind of like a Gymshark dupe. I feel like they're kind of the same brand as the other ones I bought. They fit me really cute, super stretchy as well. It's the same brand as the first Gymshark dupe I showed. Squat proof, doesn't budge as you can see. Love them. And this sports bra as well. Super cute, tie dyes now in. And I think I got these each for $3. Super great. Next, I got these leggings as well. They are ECHT. This is a known brand, kind of. The pricing is very similar to Gymshark. And I got them for $3, brand spanking new, with the brand tag and everything. I love these. These are way more comfortable than all the other ones I've had. Squat proof. I have like these little details right here on the side. Sorry guys, I've been bloated all day. But these are my next find. They're Nike Pro leggings, cheetah print. And I just had to get them. I'm so addicted to buying cheetah print and I just thought because it's not even my favorite thing. The same way as I keep buying pink and blue things. And it's not even my favorite color. But it's just your go-to. Like you know it fits you well. So these are really cute. I like them. Super comfy. Okay. Last but not least what I got were these Nike shorts. The very super popular ones. For like three to four bucks but they are a size medium and they didn't fit me as I wanted like they fit me on the bottoms but not the band wise 
So I might just give these away. Then I just got two plain jeans. I'm not going to try these on just because they're just to be around the house. And I got them for like $2. They're Levi's. And then these, I just made them into mom jeans and sewed the sides. $2 as well, just plain jeans. The last place I thrifted at, it's called Uptown Cheapstick. And the day that I went, it was their dollar day sale. So they had uh, items for like $1, $3, and $5. And at first I couldn't find anything. But once I found one thing, I just kept finding more and more and more. And everything was so spread out, I was in there for hours. So these were the last pair of leggings for my whole thrift haul. They're champion. I got these for a dollar. Super stretchy, non-see-through, and squat proof. Literally brand spanking new pretty much. I love them. And now for my next items, they're gonna be more of like the dressier than the gym sh than like leggings and gym clothes. I know. I don't know why I automatically go to leggings when I don't need any more. We have this cheetah print, zebra print, casual dress, just something to be around. Or you could honestly dress it up or dress it down. It's super cute. I like the way it fits. Super comfy. And yeah. This bra obviously is not it. Okay, so I know I said I wasn't going to try these jeans on, but for the sake of putting this top on, I put on the jeans. These are the $2 jeans that I got from the Texas thrift that I mentioned earlier. And then this top I got from Uptown Cheap Steak for a dollar. And yes, I honestly just kept grabbing things because they were a dollar, which isn't healthy. But I mean, you can never have too many haul turnecks. And then I like the little torn little detail kind of. And I thought it was really cute. So I got it. Obviously, though, this bra is not it. I'm going to be wearing it either with the strapless or maybe not even one at all. It's just for the try on purposes. Next was this little jacket that I got for $3. It's Zara. And this obviously does not go together. But seeing it now, I could probably wear like some jeans like this. This, like a bralette right underneath. And then this over it. I need to iron it and such. But yeah, I feel like it could be really cute. This is another kind of like casual dress. Perfect for, I guess, the summer or whatever. Honestly, I got this because it was just a dollar as well. And it is Fashion Nova. I like the way it fits and it's stretchy, super comfy. And I believe it was worth my dollar. This one was another dress I got for, I want to say this one I got for $3 actually. It's another Fashion Nova. I like the slit. I think it's supposed to be the under boob, but I'd rather just cover exactly like this and just show like my abdomen instead of my under boob and I really like it actually well I like the fit and everything but it's kind of sad that summer's kind of already over and where the hell am I gonna wear this to at this point in the middle of quarantine but hopefully I'll be the same size next year and I probably will be because it's so hard for me to gain weight but I really like it. Okay, so this one is also super cute. This one I got for $2 and it's from Forever 21. My sister seriously convinced me to buy it and I feel like it does look super cute. I'm not going to show the back because it is a little short. But I kind of like it. I just don't know where in the heck would I wear this to honestly. Probably just to take pictures and that's it because it's honestly super super cute. I just don't see myself wearing this anywhere. But yep. For the next romper we have this misguided fit and I got it I believe for $3. It is super cute. The only thing is I have to fix this little piece right here that needs to be sewn i hope i'm wearing it right because i don't know if i have to like lift it up a bit more it's supposed to be lower not really sure and i really need to invest in some boob tape because i feel like this isn't meant to be worn like with a bra considering it's like connected here really thin so if y'all know any places that have good quality boob tape let me know down below or message me through my social medias it's my favorite of them all is this super hot dress so it is also like the little 
what is this like leopard print thing going on but this dress hugs all my body parts like so perfectly and in the right way like look at this close up my waist is cinched and the back like look at how it hugs the booty and then the little showing off of the leg wow love this dress my favorite of them all and this one i literally it caught my eye right when i was in line and i just went to go grab it it was three dollars last two things i got from this place honestly they were i didn't even grab these i think she accidentally put them in my cart or in my little purchase or whatever but it's this adidas shirt and i honestly don't mind because it was a dollar it just has like this stain here but whatever i don't even remember looking at this shirt and i mean it was only a dollar for it and then the shirt i had on earlier which i definitely don't remember grabbing the shirt either even looking at it was also a dollar and it's like this adidas gray shirt I forgot to mention this purse from the Texas thrift for two dollars super cute I'm um, not with this outfit but I honestly really like it and it's super clean on the inside as well no scratches or anything even though these I didn't actually thrift they were given to me they were supposed to hit a thrift store but they were given to me by my cousin and these are super cute as well especially now that hold on, this is how they go especially now that fall's coming in then winter these will be perfect with some jeans a big coat you know the vibes all right so that is it for my haul i hope y'all enjoyed don't forget to subscribe and like